All right, here's a video. This is an Ozark Trail 10 person tent. It's 20 feet by 10 feet. This thing is really big. It's supposed to sleep, uh, as you see here, up to 10 people, 78 inches in the cabin center height. Can fit up to three queen mattresses, 20 minutes to set it up. It's got this cool port for um, an electric cord. And it technically has three rooms. Um, I'm going to show you this now. These white sheets that are in there go inside the tent to make divider, dividers within the tent. So anyway, I put the tent up already because it was going to be too difficult to show you how to assemble it in video because of how big this thing is. So here is the tent assembled. Um, technically the three rooms are divided here and here. Um, there's a bunch of windows on the ends. The red part obviously is your, um, your, your uh, fly for the top, your rain fly. This is cool. This is a little door right here um, that you can access like your shoes, maybe even let a dog out. And here is the port they're talking about for an electrical cord. See that split like that? That's how that goes. Inside, it feels very, very big. So here again, the way these work right here, is you'll see a bunch of, not a bunch, but you'll see a, um, a hook here and a hook here. And that hangs down. Um, you've got nice little bags inside here so at the, you know you don't put your cell phone flashlight etc um, you can see how tall it is potentially but um, it literally feels like another room they give you plenty of stakes and then the only other thing I want to show you on this video um, I mean it's very well made so you're gonna get four of these poles all right these are the big thick poles notice that this um, D ring is towards the top of the tent because that's how you attach your fly um, so there's four of those and then they connect into this joint here one side is bigger than the other so obviously the bigger side which is right here goes on here and then the smaller of the two poles are what make that crisscross right there the larger ones are these right here so on the outside, those are the larger of the poles. And then they just connect like any other standard style style pole through the uh, the D-ring there. So make sure it's all spread out. I even like the fact that it has this little, almost like a doormat. It's pretty convenient. Um, it was a, I think it was $140. I, might have, I can't remember if I said that or not. Um, but it's a very, very big tent if you're going to sleep a family or... Um, want to go hunting for a couple of days definitely worth the purchase